first of all, it doesn't surprise me at all. I've seen him give speeches before. He's always authentic. He's always real. He connects with people so deeply and easily and naturally. And I know he's just a wonderful person. He's strong. He's, he understands the communities. wonderful. You guys got to experience the, the guy that we get to experience in Minnesota. We're so honored that he's going to be the Vice President of the United States. That he, we get to share with him the rest of the country where we get to experience. I'm, I'm so happy for him and his family. Because I know how good a man he is. He fights for us. Like I told him, he will sit there and change your oil and then go to the Capitol and he will actually pass a bill to help your kids in the same day. He is a great guy. And it's cool because everyone now gets to see how good he is. He's not just a fake man on the TV playing like he's a good man. He truly is the man that you see and we're truly proud of him. When I first heard, I jumped up for joy. I was yelling in my mouth. I'm like, yes, if he's a good man, I'm so happy for him. He deserves it. And the rest of this country deserves him. I think he was at the top of his game. I've known Tim a long time. I believe that he is going to be uh, Minnesota's gift to the nation in this election. Uh, we're so excited, and you know, we, to, to know him is to love him. He, he is the he's the regular guy. He's got what we call big dad energy. Um, he can relate to millions and millions of voters out there who have been waiting for somebody like Tim to run on a national state and they're about to find out what we already know about him. I'm incredibly proud, you know, when, when I ran and was elected a delegate back in May, I figured it was going to be a fairly uneventful week in Chicago, and then everything changed, and when the conversation and they threw out, you know, a half a dozen names, I'm just like, I know who the best candidate is, I know who, and we were rooting so hard, and, and when uh, Kamala picked him, we were thrilled because a bunch of us knew him as a congressman for 12 years. We've now known him for governors. He's exactly who he portrays himself to be, and I think that's something that's really missing in politics these days.